She's a bully. I don't care what your backstory is. What I know is you're freaking blackmailing girls. But oh, how it Good morning everyone, my name is Bea Mons and welcome back to Prom Nightmares. I mean Prom Dreams, right? It's still the... It's the still... It's still the... The same game, don't worry. So, where was I? I can't remember what we did last time. Alright. Right. The storage room that I'm really afraid of. Okay. Locked. All the textbooks. Tuition. I freaking swear. What? On top of the worn files, uh, file folders like a long rope. How about no? I'm really scared. I I don't like dark basements. It's like it reminds me of that scene in. <sighs> okay, take it. Oh great! Oh great! Oh great! Damn! Uh, looks like the light busted. Uh, okay. Where am I? Holy shoot. Holy shoot. Hello. Hello. Hello, dark one. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. No, not you again. Please. Please. Oh god. Oh my god. It's, it can't be. Sir, what? I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I, I called it. I called it. No, no, no way in hell that could be her. Serena's dead. She's dead. I, I have to get out of this place. Shoot! Wait, 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 wait. I freaking called it. I knew it wasn't a breakup. The way she, the way he talks about him, about her, about Serena, it doesn't sound like a freaking breakup. I freaking knew it. Okay. Holy shoot. What am I gonna do? Okay. Alright. Run, please. Run. Oh no. Should I have locked it? I should have locked it. Oh hell. Yep. You get away from me. You're not Serena. Leave me alone. I should have locked it. Okay. Lock, lock the freaking door. Lock the 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 door. Oh shoot. Uh, please let this work. Oh gosh. I'm sorry, Serena. Uh, it, it worked. Thank goodness. You... You sick bitch. <laughs> that was your doing, wasn't it? You made... You made a mantra out of Serena. Just so you could get under my skin. God damn it all. 
You'll pay for this, Dolores. Hmm. So I wonder. I mean, how does she know about Serena? What? Papers. I know what you're thinking, Kyle. Why this? Why me? Why does every girl I fall in love with have to die horribly and painfully? Maybe if you look around and retrace your steps, you'll find out. Retrace my steps. Damn it. What the hell is she up to now? Retrace my steps. What does she mean by that? Okay then. Oh, that was so good. So what do we got from that? Okay, we got the rope. We got the rope. What is the rope for? What? <gasps> Wow, glitch! Nice. <laughs> hey, girl. I know, I know. You told me to stay, to stay positive, but when weeks, months, years go by, when you find yourself stuck in the same place, dreaming the same stagnant dream, with no sign of it ever coming true. Thing optimistic becomes the hardest thing you'll ever try to do. If I if I haven't realized my dream by now, uh, will I ever? I have my whole life ahead of me, but if I'm doomed to spend it all on just waiting, oh what if? Um, there is no answer to that. But yeah, the only thing. And yeah, stay positive. Okay. Rope and elevator key. Retrace my steps. Retrace my steps. Retrace my steps. This testimony of the liar. Huh? This wasn't here before, was it? Wait a minute, this one's different from the others. The liar. That's what Claire kept calling Neela. I wonder. Oh, what is this? Is this like um? <clears throat> so Neela's side of the story. I wonder. Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> oh gosh, I almost. Okay, I thought I wasn't recording the game. Uh, yeah, I, and I remember the the frames, the FPS are showing in the game, and and they're red. That means it's recording. Okay. <clears throat> oh. Okay, I was right. Okay. Oh. What is this? Huh? A favor? What kind of favor? Well, how do I put this? <clears throat> I need you to deliver a message for me, and uh, essentially. Oh well, that sounds re reasonable enough, I guess. So, who did you want me to talk to? You know Dolores, right? Dolores Roth? Dolores? Oh. She's the one of whose, she's the one whose family owns that big energy company, right? Yeah, I know her. Uh, we take Spanish together. Ah, good. That simplifies things. Now, here, here's what I want you to tell her. Kyle Mason from the senior class wants to invite her to the prom. He would, he would ask her himself, but he's too shy. Uh, huh? Kyle is asking her to prom? I have no idea. I had no idea. I didn't think they were. <laughs> you always seem disappointed, Nia. But here's the thing, he isn't. Uh, but 
wait, I... If... If... He's not really going to answer, then... Is this a prank? Brooke, you're not asking me to lie to her, but... Are you? Aren't you quick on the up uptake? Why, yes. That's exactly what I'm asking you to do. The Lord says, well, let's just say she's standing between me and my big ticket to success. I need some way to knock her, so knock her, knock her high score, high horse. Jesus, why did I pick her first? She's a bully! And I and I figured that a small helping of humiliation would this would serve to do just that. Uh, no way. Absolutely not. I don't know what the Lord could have done to you, and I don't really want to know, to be honest, but what you're doing is horrible. Yeah. Be a badass, Nila. Oh, uh, lying to her, lying to a girl about a boy liking her, liking her is one of the cruelest things you could do. And you know, you want to, and you want to do, do it to a special needs student. Yeah, oh my god. I mean, lying to a normal person. Oh, no, that's kinda, kinda racist. Whatever. I don't know what you, what made you think I'd help you, but I've got a mind. I've got a have a, have a mind to tell the Lord myself what you're up to. Oh, yeah, go, Nila. Ever the on, ever the honest one. I see. No wonder you're the, you're you're one of the darlings of Saint Giles. In fact, you're so singly sweet to people that it makes me want to. Puke just thinking about it. Oh my god. But I have to wonder how much of that kindness of yours is genuine, is genuine and how much of it is overcompensation for your father's crimes. What? Uh, well, why are you. What? Come on, Nila. Quit playing dumb. Although, admittedly, You've become quite good at doing that. You see, my father has more than a few friends in high in high places, including the FBI. FBI. I'm assuming you've seen this the states long long enough to know what that is. Hmm? What? Th that's <laughs> my my head. Mahendra Devar, uh, su successful, ma successful businessman, a devoted husband and father by day, by day, but according to the r regional chief and a few shots of whiskey, he, he moonlights as a middleman for the mafia. Back even back in India, he was complicit in. Oh my god. <laughs> he was uh, complicit in all sorts of criminal activities. Drug trafficking, weapon trafficking, holy shit. Human trafficking. Even someone as blissfully in the land as you can see where I'm going with this. Holy frick. Oh my god. I mean crime is one thing, but blackmailing. No, no, you can't. Oh, I certainly, I most certainly can. I wonder what would happen to your family if I leak this all to the press. Perhaps Daddy Darius might get tipped off and go to the, go on to, or go on the run, or perhaps he'll spend the rest of his life behind bars. Either way, your fantasy of the perfect home life shatters instantly. And really, that's all that matters for my purposes. So what do you think? That one teeny, tiny, harmless lie, or the complete destruction of your life as you know it? Oh my god. 
the choice is yours, dear Nila. Mahai. Brooke, please, don't do this. I'll, I'll do whatever you want, but I'm begging you. Don't tear my family apart. That's a good girl. Don't you worry, the skeletons in your fam father's closet are safe with me. Now then, you prob you're already proven yourself to be quite a liar by keeping such a dark secret for so long. Surely spending, spending a convincing tale to the lords would be second nature to you, hmm? Uh, come on, don't look so glum. If anything, this gives you the chance to have cut all to yourself. Well, don't do be aware that you may have some competition should you try and move, make, make a move on him. In any case, we'll talk, talk more later. I've still got one more connection I need to take advantage of. See you around, Nila. Holy... Shoot! Holy frick! Holy frick! Why did I ever pick her? <laughs> she was my first! What? Oh my god! Oh shoot! <sighs> Dolores, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, sorry. I lied to you. You're being, you're going to be heartbroken, and it'll be my all my fault. I never wanted to hurt you like this. I never wanted to hurt anyone, but I, I didn't have a choice. I had to keep my family together. Please forgive me. I hope you'll understand one day. Oh. I mean. I mean, I would not be, but, but, um, I mean, it depends, like, you're a caring father, yeah, by day, but by night, you're like a mafia, um, yeah, it's, it's all Brooke's fault, you know, she's already got the, the senator's love. And Kyle, he didn't deserve to be used like this either. Maybe if things were different, I could have told you how I felt for the right reasons. So when was... So when was... So when was this? Nila, you ever... You were being used this whole time. Even if all... Even if... All that stuff... About your dad, that it was true. I don't blame you for putting your family first. Yeah, yeah, I know. That was, that was what I've been saying. Um, like Kyle summed it up, in like, in one sentence. Um, in fact, that this book is here, that can only mean one thing. Dolores knew, she knew Nila was being taken advantage of and. She punished her anyway. Damn you, Dolores. Oh, come on! <laughs> this is getting good! Oh, wow. <laughs> Finally, we're uncovering secrets. <laughs> we're uncovering the truth. Retrace my steps, eh? Retrace my steps. Oh wow. So what's what's this roof? Um what's this um rope for? I don't freaking know. Okay. Oh wait. 
I need to go to the uh, elevator or something. Retrace my steps. Oh, a book. The forger. Read the book? Not yet. I need to save. Okay. <clears throat> yes, I will read the book. Oh good, you're here. I was worried you won't, won't make it. Oh gosh. Here we go again. Looks like you're... Looks like our beloved MVP has time to spare for the rest of for the rest of us common folk. After all, hey, cut the crap, Brooke. We both know you wouldn't have called me over if you didn't need something. <laughs> That's an awfully rude way to talk to the person who got you into state. Oh God, you know I risk. I risk an ex expo explosion helping you fix your sta your SAT scores last year, right? I would I would think you'd be. I think you. I I think you'd be a bit more grateful. So that's what this is about, Tim. And here I was hoping I wouldn't have to worry about you coming back to bite me. Me and yes. Come on, Maggie, you really thought I'd forget about the deal we made back then? I don't give those kind of favors out for free. You know from the beginning you'd have to pay me back one day. It's just... I'm just... I'm just coming to collect on your debt, that's all. Gosh. Fine, what do you need to... What do you need me to... What do you need me to do? What? For me to do? What? Okay. Oh, nothing much. Just help me ruin a poor girl's freaking life. That's all. Frick you, Brooke. Why did I ever pick you? <laughs> you know Dolores Roth, right? Well, it turns out that she has something I want. Namely, the valedictorian title. Oh god. Huh? Wait, you're going after her? Actually, I take that back. You wouldn't be the one to pick, pick on a girl in a wheelchair, wouldn't you? What can I say? I'm an opportunist. I can't say the word. Um, I can't afford to discriminate if I'm going to get what I want. Jeez, it's like I made a deal with the devil <laughs> or something. Oh, don't be so dramatic, and you can't exactly call me the devil when you were the one willing to cheat to get your scholarship. Oh god, no. I'm sorry I can't contain, contain all the information thrown right on my face. Um, but that's besides the point. You know your way around the school's social media page, right? Yeah, I guess you could say that. Perfect, well then. Here's what you're going to do. You're going to make a post in Kyle's, Kyle Mason's name. In that post, you're going to... In the frick? Crazy pregnant woman. <laughs> um, nothing. In that post, in that post, you're going to insinuate that he wants to get, he wants to take the lords to prom. Now I don't care how you do it, just as long as, it, as, as it's believable. Just because she's disabled doesn't mean she's stupid after all. And that's it. <laughs> what a load! What a load! <laughs> you're, you're seriously. You, you seriously can't do all this about yourself? Why the hell do you need me for? Um... What? Hmm, well, 
I suppose I can, but why would I when I have a perfectly good fall girl to blame if things go wrong? Oh my god, you. And if I say no, then you can kiss your basketball career goodbye. I'll tell Dr. Ackerman about your bogus SAT scores, minimizing my own involvement, of course. You lose your scholarship and possibly your title as well. All your dreams and ambitions will come crashing down before you. <laughs> Are you willing to take that risk, Maggie? <sighs> Fine, I'll do it. But after this, we're even. No more making me do your goddamn work. Got that? Loud and clear, Maggie. I'm glad we could reach an agreement on this. And don't think I'm give, giving you the short end of the sick here. Well, I am, but there's something in it for you as well. We all know that Kyle is way too honest to ever go along with something like this. He's what we call the extrain, extraneous... Extraneous? Yeah, extraneous valuable, you see. And in order to control that variable, we have to take, we have to make absolutely sure how he goes to prom with someone else, preferably one of us. Uh, wait a second, You're, you, are you saying, I'm saying that this will be the perfect opportunity to score yourself a free, pr free prom date. Oh my god, uh, with a popular student, no less. And in fact, why don't we make it into a game, you and I? Whoever can get Kyle to ask, ask them out to prom wins. Surely the sportswoman in you can't say no to that. Oh no, <laughs> this is horrible. This is so messed up, then miss out. Oh my gosh. Uh, Alright then, you're on. Just try not to cry yourself to sleep when I went on him over. Holy shit. Freaking hacker. Then the computers are not... <laughs> are not in the map. Damn it, Brock. You just can't let... Let go of a good opportunity to screw up people over, can you? Can't believe I'm actually going along with this humiliating and innocent person. Wasn't exactly how I planned on ending my school, high school career. Ugh, snap out of it, Maggie. It's just one stupid page and then you can get, you can get, you can put that two-faced snake behind you for good. It may be not fair to Dolores, but who cares about her anyway? This is my future we're talking about. I'm not going to lose it all to that bitch Brooke. I'll show her. I'll definitely show her. When I steal Kyle away from under her nose, she's gonna regret She's gonna regret ever missing with me. She did. She did. I'm sorry, Brooke. I'm so no, I'm sorry. Oh, no. Why did I even pick her? Jeez, Maggie, I have no idea. You always did hate to lose, but this was one situation where you really couldn't win, could you? Deep down, I know you didn't want to hurt anyone. If someone held my future hostage, like yours was, I don't know what to do. I do either. But I guess Dolores didn't see it that way in her eyes. You were just as guilty as the others. In her eyes, 
you all deserve to die and no matter what you may have done I'll never forgive her for that really? really? I mean they have a reason to die anyway <gasps> what the frick? Are you freaking serious? Are you freaking serious? That one... That one crack! That one crack! And not the good kind of crack! <laughs> Come on, Kyle! Have you ever heard the phrase, Don't step on a crack! Or fall! Or you'll fall and break your back! Wait, is that a saying? Although I guess technically you fell and broke your neck. <laughs> oh my god. I just I just love the Lurses and game over quotes. Uh but enough S semantics semantics. Uh only a fool would put their weight on the floor. So fragile. Oh come on. I didn't see it, sorry, I didn't notice it. If I were you, I'd come back when the da dangers pass. Ish. But really, that's only a suggestion. If you'd truly like to fall <laughs> to your doom again, be my guest. Death will give you a no escape from this world after all. Uh, I still got this rope. I don't know where. Where. This should be. It's not. Heartbreak. Huh. I wonder where this rope goes. What's this doing here? Surely there's a... What if I take the wallet? Um, let's just save for good measure. Uh, what if I take this wallet? Hmm. Yeah. I took the wallet. Okay, huh. No ID, no credit cards, dollar dollar bills. Huh? Dollar dollar bills? Uh, it's empty. Okay. Maybe if I give to the bathroom lady? No? Fine then. Man, I really feel bad for 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 Nila and Maggie. Oh, okay. Okay, the testimony of the mastermind. Okay, not yet. Let's save. Okay. Now. Yep. Oh, okay. So what's your story? Brooke? Frickin' Brooke? Uh... What? What are you doing? Honey, please! Will you just calm down for... Don't you dare, honey, me! You piece of... Shite! God, Edgar! What the hell have you... Have you done? And that was our money! Our daughter's money! And you wasted it uh, all on a goddamn Vegas RG. Jeez! <laughs> With your little DC frat buddies. She was going to yell with that money, and now you've. you've... Jesus, Fran Bo! <laughs> Fran Bo, yeah. Uh, don't you think I know all that? Don't you think? Don't you think I regret it? Huh. As if a filthy lying cheating rat like you could even entertain the, the concept of regret. Oh my god. The only reason I'm calling, I'm not calling the present, my attorney this second, is because I don't want to ruin Brooke's life more than it already has been. Friend. 
get out, just get off of my side, Edgar. I don't care which of my mistre of your mistresses run uh, you run off to. Just get the hell out of my house. Daddy, you're really piece. You're really, you're you're a really piece of work. You know that. Even I never thought you could screw up this badly. Oh, the daughter, the senator. Yeah. Well, screw him. I never needed his help anyway. I'll find my own way to deal. Oh, Jesus. And one day I'll be laughing at that bastard from the Oval Office. Office. Um, even if I uh, have to kill to get there. Okay. I mean, look. Look, I mean, <laughs> that kind of break up of your family, man. It's, yeah, it's horrible, but you don't need to kill someone to, to, you don't need to kill someone to get to yell, you get to get your, oh my gosh, it's not really the life of, of rich, rich people, they would kill someone to get to, um, uh, just to, the, to their standards, let's see, it should be around here somewhere, hmm. Mackenzie really is an air identity. Forgetting to log out of this stuff computer like this for shame. Oh no, Miss Mackenzie. Here it is the great da database. Whoever graduates with the highest GPA gets an honor of valedictorian and that person gets a full scholarship for the school of their choice. If my name is at the top of this list. Um, huh? No way. Can't be. I'm only sec second highest? Me? Shoot, this is bad. W without that, without that scholarship, I... I... Uh, well then. Who, who the, who's the smart ass trying to steal my title, I wonder? It's Lars Ross. That... That little trust fund baby. Uh, I can't let myself to, to uh, 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 I can't let myself be undone by by goddamn by some goddamn crippled girl. I have some I have something I have to do something about her. Something that will get her out of the picture entirely or at least make her gra grades suffer. Holy shit. Brooke, is that you? Come on, you know students are in the love behind the desk. Oh, Mr. McKenzie. Sorry about that. I was just looking for, for my earring, that's all. I didn't mean to break any rules. Oh gosh, you, do you need me to, do you need me to look for it? I just found- I just- I just now found it, actually, but I appreciate the offer. Now, if you'll excuse me. You freaking bitch! Oh my god, I don't care what your story is. I don't care what your backstory is. What I know is you're freaking blackmailing girls to lie- Oh god. What I need now is a plan, something damaging, but also discreet. Whether she drops out of school entirely or tries to kill herself, I won't, it won't matter, as long as I can get my hands on that scholarship. But I won't be able to pull this off alone. I'm going to need help, but, and I think I know just the people to ask. Holy freaking b <laughs> I'm sorry. I just hate that. Brooke, I have no idea where you like this. That you can be so cruel. 
was everything we shared together all just a part of your plan to ruin some, somebody else? I think I'm starting to understand why Dolores hated you so much. See? But still, to kill so many people over it. Hey. Come on. Wow, that was intense. I'm... I freaking hate her so much. Freaking hate her. Romeo and Juliet. The young lady of Charlotte. Oh, that wasn't. <laughs> I I thought it was like King Arthur. <laughs> I still don't know where this rope is for. I don't know where to go. I mean, I've retraced every steps. Um. Oh, different. Uh, now you know the truth. How does it feel to be such a poor, uh, such, uh, such a poor, uh, judge of character? What? 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 Judge? Judgment? Here? Uh. Why didn't I look for this first? Scalpel. No doubt she has something in mind for me to do with this. Guess I've got no choice but to play along. Yeah. What? I bet. I bet I need to just just her to do surgery on that that uh on that thing um on in the chemistry i don't know biology biology classroom